What's going on guys? Kevin here today and today I have another addition to the Tinker Tweak series and I figured I'd start doing this monthly. Now basically what I'm going to be doing in this from now on is I'm going to be giving you guys the coolest tweaks of the month. Now the coolest tweaks of the month I found three this month, three that were Tinker Tweak worthy I guess you could say and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to show them to you guys. So the first one is called scrolling board and basically if you've ever used infinity board that is probably exactly what it is, but it adds a little bit extra functionality. Basically what you can do is you can set up pages on your dock, but then on top of that it gives you your music controls over to the left and right, and then you have some more um, options in the settings tab for this tweak. So I'm going to go ahead and get to that, so just go to scrolling board. So you can select a whole bunch of plugins to go on there and stuff. And it's just super customizable. It's a lot better than Infinity Board because also it's a lot more reliable and doesn't cause your springboard to crash. Now the next tweak I got for you guys is called Barrel. And this is more of a tweak, not for functionality or anything, but more to customize your device like a lot of Android users have and a lot of them brag about it. Now as you may know, iOS users who are jailbroken are far more customizable than any Android, any Android device for that per se. And basically you can customize literally anything. So with this tweak, all you can really do is you customize 3D animations for your page uh, swiping. And there's a whole bunch to choose from. If you go to the settings app, you can go ahead and go in there. Uh, you got some page slide down, so if I were to go, it goes up and down. So there's a whole bunch of cool animations you can do for swapping pages rather than just the stock back and forth. So that's definitely awesome, and if you don't like... Um, Barrel, or you just want to take a break from it right now, I'm taking a break from it, you can go ahead and choose normal, no effects, no need to uninstall or anything, and you can just go back to being normal. So the last tweak I got for you guys is called More Lines and Notification Center. Now if you're running iOS 5, or any iOS 5 devices for that matter, then you'd know Notification Center is a huge addition to iOS. Now with this huge addition, people are obviously going to customize it and tweak it, and all that good stuff. So I found a cool tweak for you guys just to show off. It's called More Lines and Notification Center. Now basically what, what this allows you to do is put more lines of your notifications in your notification center. So you may have noticed that with texts or emails or anything on your iPhone or iPod, um, you're going to notice it gets cut off. Like if I were to set it to 1, then all of my notifications get cut off and you still have infinite scrolling in there. Now what no, uh, More Lines and Notification Center does is it allows you to display pretty much the whole message with up to 12 lines, 12 lines in Notification Center to go ahead and read all of your messages without really having to go to the app unless you absolutely need to. Now basically what, uh, what the really attraction to this is, is you can read it on your home screen, you can read it in Notification Center, but unfortunately it doesn't allow more lines at the top. Other than that, guys, um, that is a quick notification center add-on. So, guys, uh, that's it for this video. Uh, it was a short video just to show you guys some tweaks I found this month. That's usually what the series is going to be about now. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. See you guys later.